Connection established. Welcome. After installing Home Assistant manually, I would say it's time to install Home Assistant with Anus and test it out. In a previous video, we've installed Home Assistant Core without add-ons and created all configuration manually. If you're interested about that, check video in the top right corner. To find links, check video description. In this video, I will not go deep in details, so look for all the steps on Home Assistant webpage. I'm already on Home Assistant webpage and here I'll download Raspbian OS image for Raspberry Pi 3 because I'll use it on Raspberry Pi 3B+. Then download Balina Etcher and add Raspbian image on microSD card. Now I will complicate it a little bit and take option to have static IP. If you don't want this option, you can skip it and your Raspberry will be given some IP by DHCP, which you can then find with tool like Angry IP Scanner. I need to create a folder with name network in root of USB stick named config and inside network folder I need to add file called my dash network without any extension. Now let's add config to that file. I'll go for wired connection to LAN with static IP. Copy and paste inside and let me change IPv4, IP, mask and DNS as I want. You can set it as you want. Ok, plug USB stick in Raspberry. This will add network config before Home Assistant installation. Let's return to installation. Insert SD card to Raspberry. Plug UTP cable in and connect power supply. Now wait about 20 minutes for Raspberry to download and install latest version of Home Assistant. After some time, you should be able to see Home Assistant web interface if you entered IP of Raspberry and port 8123 in your browser. Or you can simply enter homeassistant.local and then port 8123 if you're not sure about IP. OK, create user for Home Assistant. Let's install Mosquito MQTT Broker. I was playing a little bit with options to see how it works. What we want is to create a light bulb button and edit configuration YAML to connect it with ESP8266 or MQTT broker. To edit configuration, I used File Editor plugin in Home Assistant. I use broker default name core-mosquito, username and password that is also in C++ code. Configuration in C++ code can be found in video description. I will use modified USB to DTL module to upload code to ESP8266. Then I'll take switch module for 
from previous projects and insert ESP8266 in it. Let me connect module to Raspberry with USB to DTL module just to give it 5 volt power. This should do it. Take some time and play around with options. If you have any question or suggestion, just write it in the comments section. And that's it. I hope you learned something new and found useful information in this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like it. And if you want to see more content like this, subscribe. Good luck.